What's up everyone, I'm Joe from Mattress Clarity. If you're worried about hip pain or you have hip pain, you've come to the right video. Because today I'm gonna be talking about six mattresses that are very good for hip pain, people worried about hip pain. I'm gonna be telling you everything you need to know about these mattresses, why they're good for hip pain, and who they're a good fit for. Basically by the end of the video, you have a pretty good idea of which one of these you might wanna get, so stay tuned. If you want to learn more about these mattresses, see more of our top picks, read mattress comparisons, or get exclusive coupons, check all that information out on our, our website, mattressclarity.com. All right, if you have hip pain, you may have a condition where it gives you hip pain, or a mattress may actually give you hip pain if you have pressure points building up. Typically, what you're going to want to do is just find a softer mattress, one that relieves pressure very well. So there's no one best mattress for everyone, but we have six here that have different types, different types of feels. I think you're really going to like one of these mattresses. I'm going to be a little bit softer, definitely very pressure relieving overall. Uh, we also have Martin on my team. He's going to kind of jump in. He's much bigger than I am, give a different perspective about these mattresses as well. So having said that, let's jump into some top picks. First one on the list is the Layla mattress. If you sleep on your side or your back, you're not gonna feel really any pressure points. If you have hip pain, this is gonna be a very good option for you. It's a very innovative mattress. It's got a firm side and a soft side, so it's flippable with two different sides. If you sleep on your stomach, you probably want the firm side. If you sleep on your back or side, you're probably gonna want the soft side. Very comfortable memory foam that's copper infused. For me, it just kind of melts away any sort of pressure. So if you're really worried about hip pain, uh, pressure points building up, Layla is definitely gonna be a very, very good option for you. Next one on the list is the NOLA mattress. I really like this for side sleepers that are light and medium weight. So it relieves pressure very, very well. It has something called air foam, which is kind of a memory foam substitute. It's gonna be more responsive, potentially even better pressure relief than memory foam is. I think that is potentially the case for light and medium weight side sleepers. So if you sleep on your side, you're kind of light and medium weight, you want really good pressure relief, don't wanna build up the pressure points on your hips or even your shoulders, I would definitely take a look at the NOLA mattress. Next one on the list is the Helix mattress. With Helix, it's all about customization and options. So you have two options with Helix. You can take a quiz, and based on the answers to the questions of the quiz, they'll give you a personalized mattress for you, or you can pick from one of their pre-selected models. So they have the Helix Sunset and the, the Helix Moonlight as well, um, softer options. So if you have hip pain, kind of worried about getting a softer mattress, definitely look at those two, or take the quiz, and they'll give you a personalized recommendation for you. So there's a lot to like about the Helix. I also have the Lux option. So if you want kind of luxury upgrades, you can pay a little bit more to get the Lux version of those mattresses. So there's a lot to like about the Helix mattress. Next one on the list is the Purple Hybrid Premier 4-inch version. So this is gonna be very, very good for heavier sleepers or people who just sleep on their side. It has four inches of this very highly pressure relieving material called hyperelastic polymer gel um, that this purple is known for. It leaves pressure just very, very well on our pressure map testing. You don't really see any red whatsoever. So it's a very good job at relieving pressure. It's also kind of temperature neutral as well, which is really great. It's gonna be very durable as well and very supportive as well because it has coils underneath that. So if you're a heavier sleeper and need extra support, also pressure relief, definitely take a look at this mattress. Next one on the list is the Wink Beds softer version. So Wink Beds is a traditional inner spring mattress. It has a coil on coil construction, it also has a Euro style pillow top. So if you're used to kind of traditional spring mattresses, you'll definitely find this to be a good fit for you. The softer version is gonna be great for hip pain. You're gonna get the support from the two layers of coils, but have a little bit softer of a pillow top feel on top there. So again, if you're used to kind of that traditional spring feel, um, you want a little bit more pressure relief and not have hip pain, but still have that traditional spring feel, then definitely check out the Wink Beds softer version. Last but not least is the Nectar mattress. This is our best budget pick. It has four inches, a uh, very, very comfortable pressure relieving memory foam. So if you sleep on your back or your side, you're definitely not gonna feel any uh, pressure on your hips whatsoever. It's definitely good for hip pain. Just very comfortable overall. One of the most comfortable mattresses I've ever slept on. And it's a very good price as well. So it's just a very good value. So if you don't wanna break the bank, you want some nice pressure relieving, comfortable mattress that's not gonna build up any pressure points on your hip, definitely check out the Nectar. Hey guys, Martin here to offer a different perspective. Joe's 5'9", 160. I'm 6'7", 250. I'm a larger person than Joe, and he made this list of the best mattresses for hip pain. And out of these six, I think five are a good match for larger people like myself. And the main thing you want to think if you're a heavier person like myself is, especially with hip pain, you don't want to bottom out in a mattress and kind of drive your hip into the support layers of that mattress. So again, out of these six, I think five should work for larger people like myself. First off, the Purple Hybrid Premier four inch, very good match for larger people like myself because of that hyper elastic gel polymer. Definitely cradles my body. I'm a larger person. You have four inches of that material though. I don't bottom out whatsoever. Kind of cradles my hips. No pain there at all. Then we have the Helix mattresses. Now what's great about Helix is they will customize a mattress to meet your body type and your sleeping position. So take their sleep quiz on their website. I'm a larger person. Put my weight in there. They'll make a mattress made to fit exactly what I am looking for. Even if I'm dealing with hip pain. They also have a mattress called the Helix Plus made specifically with larger people in mind. 
Now, thinking about that, we also have the Winkbed Soft mattress. Now, Winkbed Soft is great because you have the supportive coils and a plush kind of pillow top on top of that. So you get that comfort of the pillow top, but also the supportive coils beneath that. And as a larger person, you don't want something so soft with no support. So good balance of comfort and support for larger people like myself. Then moving on, we have the Layla mattress. Now, as Joe mentioned, Layla is a flippable mattress. So that's great because on the soft side, a very thick comfort layer. Even for a bigger person like me, I'm not bottoming out in the mattress, feeling some great pressure relief, especially on my hips. And then last but not least, we have the Nectar mattress. Now, Nectar has that great slow moving memory foam feel. So especially when I'm on my side, I kind of slowly sink into the mattress, feel almost no pressure on my hips. <music> All right, before we close out this video, I wanted to go over some frequently asked questions about hip pain and mattresses. All right, what kind of mattress is best for hip pain? Well, it really just depends on your personal preference, but you definitely want something that's gonna be a little bit softer and just relieve pressure a little bit better. I know we talked about that earlier in the video. That's kind of what these top picks have, have kind of indicated, that a little bit softer and relieve pressure very well. All right, is a firm or soft mattress better for hip pain? Well, definitely gonna be a soft mattress. You don't want pressure points to build up in your hips um, or shoulders really anywhere. Um, so definitely have a softer over a firm mattress. All right, can a bad mattress cause hip pain? Well, it's definitely possible. If it's a little bit too firm, doesn't relieve pressure very well, maybe it sags, something like that, where kind of pressure points build up, a bad mattress can definitely cause uh, hip pain. So how should you sleep to avoid hip pain? Well, I think sleeping on your back or stomach is probably a good idea if you want to generally avoid hip pain. If you sleep on your side, it's definitely going to concentrate a lot of pressure uh, right on your hip. If that's the case, just make sure that you have a softer mattress. But you also can just kind of test it out. So just kind of test different sleeping positions until you find one that's comfortable uh, on your hips. All right, that's basically it. Hopefully I've given you a good overview of these six mattresses. You know what to look for if you have hip pain or you're worried about getting hip pain. If you're interested in any of these particular mattresses, definitely check out the individual reviews we've done on both our website and YouTube channel. We also come out with great new content every week, so consider subscribing to our channel. And once again, let me know if you have any questions.